Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to see how to monitor Salesforce past flows. In Salesforce flows, we have pass element. Using the pass element, we can pass the flow and it will resume based on the conditions we set or we can also wait for a platform event to trigger so that the uh, uh, passed flow will fire. Uh, in this video, we are not going to talk more about pass element, but we are going to see how to monitor it. For uh, this video, I created a demo. I created a auto launched flow and uh, I have a pass element here. I'm, I have given the name as pass flow and uh, for the path I am giving 15 minutes pass. For the resume event, to resume the flow I am using a specified time instead of platform event. Time source will be specific time. In the defined resume time I am using the base time as pass time. This is a very a formula which I have created for 15 minutes. I will show you how I created this uh, pass time variable with 15 minutes window. So I created a date time data type uh, formula field with the flow dot current date time plus 2 by 1440 but actually it should be 15 by 1440 so that it is 15 minutes flow current date time so the current date time of the flow running plus 15 by 1440 will give 15 minutes uh, that will be added to the current data time. Once the 15 minutes is passed, it will update my account record based on the account ID that is passed and the description will be set to pass time. Whatever uh, time that is passed, um, is set that is 15 minutes so now if the time is 8 it, sh it should be 8 15 will be there with the date and time this is for just a demo I am updating my account record in order to call this auto launch to flow I created a trigger in the account trigger whenever the account record is updated that account ID is passed to the sample pass flow and then the flow is invoked so using my trigger I am invoking the flow once the flow is invoked it will go to the fl uh, flow it will pass for 15 minutes and then we should be able to check that here let's uh, check that so here workflow pro uh, ruler process name I'm giving it as starts with sample okay let me delete this so that we can test it now We can also check it in past flows and interviews. So there are two places where we can monitor one time based flow and the other one is past and failed flow interviews. If I edit an account record, it will call my trigger and the trigger will pass the account ID to the flow and the flow will be executed and then the pass element will be executed so let's try that 
so I'm just simply editing my account record and uh, I'm saving it now the time is 721 so if I search created date is 721 scheduled date is 736 so within 15 minutes the sample uh, pass flow will update my account record you can also check it here in past and failed flow interviews so in order to troubleshoot and monitor pass element in the Salesforce flow then we can make use of time-based workflow in Salesforce setup and also passed and failed flow interviews I hope it was helpful thank you for watching